And now to a morning original. These are stories you'll see first on Wake Up Central. Artificial intelligence in schools may not be something you've quite opened your mind yet to. But school districts in Arkansas are getting ahead of the inevitable. Wake Up Central's Michaela Johnson joins us now with how one local district is opening up the discussion with its teachers. Michaela. Good morning, Hayden and Karen. Artificial intelligence and chat GPT has taken the world by storm, bringing up fears while pushing the limits of what's possible. The Pulaski County Special School District acknowledged both sides of that, preparing their teachers for what may come with AI and the classroom. Chat GPT, an artificial intelligence chatbot, has taken the world by storm. Many are learning just how much it can do. I wouldn't imagine, honestly, that in the 2023 school year, that a student could say, write a three paragraph essay and that it would spit that out to them in five seconds. Yet quick automated responses is the essence of ChatGPT. Rolled out earlier this year, it allows users to refine and steer a conversation towards a desired length, format, even style. Artificial intelligence to build out answers and build things and create things. It's like a virtual personal assistant. Everybody's amazed or terrified. Whether either is true, Dr. Tyler Tarver, education trainer and speaker, trained Pulaski County Special School District teachers on the negatives, positives, ins and outs of ChatGPT to possibly take back to their students. It's used best not when it does the work for you, but when it helps you do the work better. My biggest takeaway is that it's going to change education. Carrie Owens is a middle school teacher, and her top concern, along with many other teachers, is cheating. You know, they're just going to abuse it. They're not ever going to learn how to use it. But Owen says cheating has always been a concern, even before AI or chat GPT came around. So she sees a solution in three steps. First, teachers need to learn how the technology works, then how it can be used and abused. And finally, teach students how to use it properly in the classroom. Well, if you don't teach them how to use it properly, they're still going to use AI, chat GPT, bar. They're going to use these things to do stuff for them, but they're not going to be as good as if you help guide them through that. Owen says while she'll be teaching students how to use ChatGBT, she's excited for ChatGBT to help her out too. I will be using it to write lesson plans. It can do that so much quicker than I can. While Owens is open to integrating ChatGBT into the classroom in the upcoming school year, she's unsure what the future, even less than a decade, looks like for AI and schools. I have no clue. I have no idea, you know, and but I do think in five years, it's going to be dramatically different stepping into an English classroom, especially. Mm. Yeah, lots to take in. <laughs> yes, lots to talk about. It's just it's hard to even wrap my mind around. Oh, it. no <laughs> doubt. So they're going to be using it in the classroom. Mm -hmm. It's going to happen. How do we use this thing appropriately for students? So that's the that's the big question yeah. here. And I was I had the same question. But it's so ChatGPT. You can ask it anything. But they don't want you to the students in particular to put it in and just say do the work for me. Yeah. So mm -hmm. let's say you give them an assignment to write an essay, three paragraphs. They write that. They put that into ChatGPT. They say, how can I make this better? Oh. And that's different ways like that. Or they're in history class and maybe they missed a class or something. They're like, I need to know about the American Revolution or George Ooh. Washington. And so they say, ChatGPT, tell me about the American Revolution. And that way you're just getting some information that way. Okay. And not just letting it do it for mm -hmm. you. You're just making it your make your work better is how you do it. That the way. honor system. Sure. Exactly. We're going by the honor <laughs> system. Well, exactly. Well, honest Dave never had ChatGPT. <laughs> No, there you go. No. I know. It's, there's a lot to it. And there's even so much that we didn't get to cover. Mm. And yeah. so I'll have more on in an article on THB11.com after the cool. show because there's a lot to talk about, a lot, a lot of questions too. Especially the basics. Yes. Just starting there. Thank uh -huh. you, Michaela. Absolutely. Appreciate it.